Mr. Babu Samuel Sr. receiving a standing ovation from invitees and the band he spent 13 years with. He is credited for bringing the pan instrument to the Royal Police Forces Marching Band. Samuel is widely recognized as being among the top panists in Antigua and Barbuda. He suffered a stroke in October of 2021, which took a severe toll on his ability to perform, but his spirits are still high. I'm in the hands of God. Whenever he's ready, he'll do what he wants with me. There's nobody can stop that. So, I'm just hanging in. A member of the Halcyon Steel Orchestra from the 70s, a memory which remains fresh for Samuel, was the dominance of Halcyon during the four peak from 1992 to 1995. Because it was me and a bunch of young Young kids that are now men and women. Everything was on me. And I, even though I'm sick, they still come and look for me. He says he still finds time for his pan whenever he feels the need to, because pan means everything to him. It's a feeling from the heart to the head, not the head to the heart, from the heart to the head to the pan. I'm a street man. And you know, pan take me off the streets. I mean, I could have been in prison or something like that, or pan saved me from that. So, I say thank God for putting pan inside of me. And me getting so seriously involved with Pan that the rest of the world didn't exist for me. The veteran Pan is, says the future of Pan is alive and well in Antigua and Barbuda since there are so many young people engaged in the art form and that is good to see. Terry Andrew, ABS News.